So this box I had already opened, but I figured since I wanted to share the experience um, on video, I retaped it. But there is a box in here that I have not opened yet at all, so that will be nice. That's just so cute. So our very first item is the Titsy Totsy. And since it's close to Valentine's Day, it's pink. And that really irritates me because I didn't want it to be pink. I wanted it just just to be the regular Titsy Totsy. But I think I think it'd be all right. Like I think it'd be a neat experience to have a pink bath. It's just I wanted my Titsy Totsy being completely clear, thank you. I that's just how I feel. What is you? Oh wait, no. Ingredients. Sodium bicarbonate, citric acid, seven rosebuds. Rose Absolute, ooh, Germanium Oil, Lemon Oil, Jasmine Absolute, Oris Root Powder, Propylene Glyune, Red 27 and Red 28. Our next item is Cheer Up Buttercup Bath Bomb. It has sodium bicarbonate, citric acid, cocoa butter, lemon myrtle oil, Yoshi Yellow, the blue cornflowers I thought were um, juniper flowers. The creamer that I use, I use Vanilla Bliss. Drawing a bath in the other part of the house, cause we've got two bathtubs. Two bathtubs, one's in the master bedroom, the other's right behind you, through the wall. So our next product is Metamorphosis, which actually makes me think of the movie Metropolis. Metamorphosis contains sodium bicarbonate, citric acid, uh, black pepper oil, cinnamon leaf oil, fragrance silver and black luster, red 27, red 33, yellow 5, yellow 6, green 5, red 40, yellow 10, yellow 10 lake and blue one. I didn't know this had blue in it. That's cool. Oh, here we have Fuzz. Fuzz, is it Fuzz? I, I loved Kira Rose's video where she did Furs and I don't think I have any of the other bath oils that were in that video, but her, her moment where she didn't know what this was called just made me laugh just so, so much. I loved it. It was just, She's so adorable, and she's from the UK, so her accent is adorable. Just her talking is adorable, so I really admire her her honesty in, in moments like, like that. And this contains organic shea butter, fair trade organic co cocoa butter, fragrance, extra virgin coconut oil, organic jojoba oil. Lush totally wants to hire me. One of the most conflicting products I have ever bought before is Blue Skies and Fluffy White Clouds. This bubble bar smells like I almost like it, and I really want to like it, but it's like oceanic old lady bathroom. It's so weird. It's almost like laundry, and it's almost like herbs, and it's almost like that spectrum of crispy, uh, to like, like, I want myself to smell a certain spectrum of smells, and it almost smells like what I want myself to smell like. Its ingredients are sodium bicarbonate, cream of tartar, cornstarch, patchouli oil. Ooh, that's probably why I like it. Frankincense resinoid. That's probably why I like it too. Cinnamon leaf oil. Um, me oh, that's probably why it smells, um, slightly, almost crisp herby is because of the cinnamon. Maybe. So I'm gonna save the box for last, <laughs> the, the box that's in here, but I have revelations. Woo it looks so much like my triangle I wanna get. It looks so, it's so triangly and it's leafy and it smells like that deep green forest bath bomb that they used to have that if you broke it in half, there was a gold brick in the middle. And I can't remember the name 
It was like trip through the forest or something like that. And it was deep, deep green, more than the uh, Lord of Misrule. It has fair trade organic cocoa butter, cream of tartar, organic shea butter, fragrance sweet wild orange oil, olive leaf absolute extra virgin coconut oil, oak moss extract, ooh, yellow five and blue one. Then I have this little soap sample of a soap I have tried before and I absolutely loved. Um, Sultana of Soap Ingredients. Rapeseed oil. Thank you for using the right name. Coconut oil. Water. Glycerin. Sorbitol. Fragrance. Dried apricots. Dried currants. Dried cranberries. Cannot pronounce those last two things. And then we have... I have not opened this. So this contains... It's raining, man! Get in a lather with our signature honey toffee scent and softening suds. Hallelujah. <laughs> Scrubby body butter. This buttery blend of honey ground almonds and cocoa butter leaves. Cocoa butter leaves skin be beautiful. 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 Honey trap lip balm. Hydrate lips with deeply moisturizing honey and vitamin rich wheat germ oil. Okay. Honey, I wash the kids. I remember the Honey, I Shrunk the Kids movie, and I watched that kind of frequently when I was a kid, but I haven't watched it since I was like 10. Caress your skin with a softening toffee scented soap. Perfect for the whole family. I'm not sure if I would want to share my soap bar with uh, m my, my parents. Do! Ooh! More! Mmm! <gasps> oh, I want to take a bite of it! I don't know what it smells like, but it smells like something I've eaten before. I've, I've tried it. I've, I've, I've eaten that. This is that first thing. Let's open it. Mmm, this is the thing that smells like food. Oh, wow. I had no idea this would smell so good. Oh, it's like, it literally feels like chocolate. Like, like white chocolate. I really want to take a bite of it so bad. This looks kind of soft. Ooh, that is kind of soft. Is it a soap bar? Oh, I don't like that. It's sweet at first, and then it gets like this almost background, back of your mouth, kind of. I don't get that. That's weird. It's raining man. That smells particularly similar to that. I bet it smelled different in the shower. Yeah, it's almost like this. It's almost exactly like that. And then there's the Honey Trap lip balm. Mmm. That's very light. It ha it's very creamy. So that is my Lush haul. I have not taken a shower yet today, so I'm gonna take a bath and shave my legs. That is literally the reason why I did this haul. And so I decided to uh, get these things to make it to where I could spread it out over the semester. So yeah, gonna get in the bath and try out some of these new things. Thank you.